Hey, it's Kirk Harnack with the Telus Alliance. I want to talk to you about how streaming gets done. How do you get audio from your radio station or your internet radio station? How do you get that out to the general public? Well, let's take a quick look at that using the Telos Pro Stream. How to stream audio to listeners using the Telos Pro Stream. Well, we'll start with the ProStream and let's look at what's inside of it. First of all, your audio comes in either through XLR or a live wire connection. And the first thing it gets to is the Omnia audio processing that's built in. Now, if you can use this processing, you really want to. You could bypass it if you have some external processing, but you really want to use this processing if you can. Why? Because it's designed specifically for streaming. It's designed for a bit rate reduced codec like you have in an encoder. So it doesn't do clipping and it doesn't do simple look ahead limiting. It's a very intelligent look ahead limiting along with a three band automatic gain control. There are different presets to choose from and of course you can customize any of the presets that you like. Once the audio is done being processed with the Omnia audio processing, it then goes to two different encoders. Now the ProStream has these two encoders and they're completely independent except for their audio feed coming in. You can process or you can encode, I should say, in MP3 or different flavors of AAC, like full AAC or HEAAC or even the very popular HEAAC V2, which is very popular for streaming because it's a low bit rate and yet it sounds really good. So you have two completely independent encoders there. Each encoder has its own little mini shoutcast server that's built into the ProStream. This is intended for your confidence monitoring, so you can check and make sure that your encoders are working okay. But you know what? If you really need to, you could use these little mini shoutcast servers to stream directly to listeners on the public internet. I'm not sure we'd recommend that unless you know you're going to have a limited number of listeners, because altogether, we're good here for about 50 streams to outside listeners, and you want to make sure you have plenty of upload bandwidth to do that. So not every facility, not every radio station or content provider has enough internet to actually make that happen flawlessly. But they're there in case you need to use it, and especially for confidence purposes. The real way that you want to stream out to the rest of the world is through... Uh, content distribution networks or CDNs. So inside the ProStream, there's this little routing matrix and you can take either encoder and assign it or either one of them to four different outputs. Now these four outputs, you can set the parameters for these for the different kinds of streaming servers that exist out in the world. For example, you can set one up specifically for Shoutcast. That's one of the presets. You can set one up for other stream encoders that may use Icecast or Shoutcast or something else, like Live 365 or a Wowza server. We'll even feed to a Wowza server or to a CDN like Akamai. The point is, you have choices here, and you can select the correct choice for your chosen content distribution network. If you want to get started in a small way, there are plenty of Shoutcast servers available out there for a very low monthly fee. A few of them are even free for a small number of listeners, so you can try that out. We'll show you how to do that exactly on another episode. But this is how you get from audio going into your ProStream through the audio processing, two different encoders, and either streaming directly to listeners or through a content distribution network. Oh, and here's a, the differentiation between what's inside the ProStream and the part of your network, the part of the services that are outside of the ProStream. So I hope you enjoyed that, how to stream audio to listeners using the Telos ProStream. Be sure you tune in this channel for other helpful tips on Telos products. Thanks.